With the one-day international series tied at one all, Australia won the toss and chose to bat first in Friday's third match versus Sri Lanka. But it was the tourists who struck the first major blow. Angelo Matthews continues. Warner doesn't get the ball in the middle of the bat. The catch is taken. After David Warner was dismissed in the third over in Brisbane, fellow opener Phil Hughes followed in the sixth as Sri Lankan paceman Nuwan Kulasekara single-handedly destroyed Australia's innings. Kulasekara has got a shout and he's been given. First ball, big hooping in-swinger, he hasn't been watching TV. The 30-year-old swing bowler snagged five wickets in his first six overs as the hosts slumped to six for 30. It's another one! Five wickets for Kulasekara. Then Lassith Malinga got in on the act. Yes! Another one! Lassith Malinga back to his very best. Malinga took three wickets before the home team's last two batsmen, Mitchell Stark and Xavier Doherty, put up some resistance. Doherty crashes it through the covers. Stark and Doherty were the only Australians to reach double figures as the hosts passed their lowest ever ODI score. Stark and Doherty scored 34 for the last wicket before the latter was dismissed in the 27th over. That's a leading edge and that's going to be out. That's it. Australia are all out for 74, the third worst total in their ODI history. With just 74 to defend, Clint Mackay gave Australia some early impetus. Out! Well held by Warner. Crunching cut shot. But the home side needed to be flawless in the field if they were to pull off an improbable victory. Believable. That's in the air and dropped. There was a chance. Tilakaratna Dilshan scored 22 for Sri Lanka, including three boundaries, before Mitchell Johnson came into the attack. Oh, and that's taken. He tried to leave it. Johnson took three wickets in his opening two overs as Sri Lanka stumbled to four for 37. But Upul Taranga and Kushal Pereira showed signs before the tea break they could steer Sri Lanka to victory. Slashed away four. Good shot, that. Despite needing just 27 runs after tea, Sri Lanka started quickly. While Australia managed two wickets after the break, missed opportunities continued to plague the men in green, and the Sri Lankans held on for a nervous win with Thassara Pereira scoring the decisive runs in the 20th over. There it is, victory for Sri Lanka. It was a lot harder than they anticipated. Sri Lanka taking a 2-1 lead in the series.